Men are like dogs. Have you ever heard one male human refer to another male human as my dog? Well, that's because men are like dogs. <laughs> I can already hear some of our female viewers going, yes, all men are dogs. No, that's not what I said. I said men are like dogs. If you insist that all men are dogs, then you have to tell us what breed is your father. <laughs> No, I'm not a dog, but I do feel Maximus and I have some identical behavior. By the way, Maximus is going to be the name of my dog when I get one, and it's going to be huge. Back on topic, men are like dogs, and it's not all bad traits. Yes, I know what comes to your mind first is that a dog has a very, very loose sexual life. A dog will have sex anywhere, anytime, with almost anything, even lucky girls. Yeah, that went dark really quickly, I'm sorry. But as bad as a male dog is, a female dog, in literal terms, a bitch is worse. Have you seen a female dog in heat? OMG. Anyway, just like dogs, men are generally more loose with their sexual lives than women. So men are ready to have sex with you, your friend, your sister, your mother, your auntie, your cousins, maybe even your nieces and nephews. Hey. Okay, that went dark really quickly again, I'm sorry. The point is, the average man is a sex machine. Always ready. Yes, we have mood swings, but when it comes to sex, we are always in the mood. Always ready to put that rod in any available hole. Just like dogs. But like I said, it's not all bad. One of the most basic instincts for a dog is protection. A dog will always protect his people and his territory, and that instinct comes naturally. Just like with men, a man is naturally a protector. A good man will always make you feel safe. He'll catch a grenade for ya, jump in front of a train for <laughs> Yes, thank you. My album is coming out soon. Anyway, back on topic, men protect. Growing up, I always felt safer when my dad was home. There can be trouble and panic in the neighborhood, but as soon as dad got home, everyone felt better. Ladies, if you don't feel safer with your man around, you are dating a tree. I'm not saying you should go and start dating violent men. That's different. Those ones are more like rabbit dogs. They are not normal. They are sick. They need treatment. But in comparison, a good dog does not go around attacking people randomly. They only attack when you come into their territory uninvited or try to hurt someone they care about. Same as good men. Dogs are also very competitive. They always want to know which dog is bigger, stronger. There's always an alpha dog. Just like with men, competition is at the base of who we are. Who has more money, who drives a bigger car, who can get the most girls, whose girlfriend is finer, sexier. That's why most men love sports. And also why, in my opinion, men are more driven to walk in general than women. Men love to walk much more than women do. And it's not about the walk, it's about the man's desire to dominate, compete, be the biggest, baddest alpha dog. On the other hand, at the heart of every hardworking queen is a princess who would rather sit back and be spoiled. But let's have this debate to another day. We need to stay on topic. No idea why that's so hard for me. Next, dogs are loyal and men are also very, very loyal, especially Nigerian men. <laughs> calm down, calm down. Hear me out, okay? Yes, men cheat a lot, which is largely due to our biological makeup. Calm down. I'm not saying that is right or that is okay. Calm down. But it's something to consider. We'll have that debate too in another video, I promise. Anyway, when I say loyalty here, I'm not talking about sex. I'm saying if a man has your back, he's got your back. A woman will quicker betray her friends than a man would. Betrayal is a lot more common amongst women than it is amongst men. Which is why a lot of girls would rather be friends with guys than with their fellow girls. This is all true. Trust me. But feel free to disagree with me in the comment section, of course. And don't worry, we'll have this debate too in another video. You have to follow us and keep track of these videos for real. Anyway, the point is, just like dogs, men are loyal. Yes, a dog will never hesitate to have sex with anything that crosses its path, but that dog is loyal to his people, just like a man is loyal to his people. And yes, dogs are goofy and playful, just like men are goofy and playful. We love to play. We love games. It's why we do silly things when we are together. And also why the women in our lives keep complaining that we are giving too much attention to our PlayStation and Xbox. You know why? Because women hate fun and are evil creatures tend to make our lives more difficult. <laughs> Just kidding. Anyone who knows me personally knows that I love and adore women. Fascinating creatures. I imagine Adam wandering about aimlessly in the Garden of Eden, all cheerful and happy, not a care in the world. Look at him, wandering about aimless. We need to find a way to make his life more complicated. Hmm, what do you have in mind? I have a project I'm working on. I call her Woman. She will turn his perfect world upside down. <laughs> I'm sorry I play too much. I can't help it, I'm a man. Which is to say, I'm irresponsible and I need a woman in my life to make me more responsible and sensible. But until that happens, I'm gonna keep coming at you with these ridiculous videos. <laughs> We're out of time. Until next time, thanks for watching. I love you all and that's on period. Peace. Paranormal. Battery! Like and subscribe. <laughs>